got one last zone, and then we're done with Arrow the Acrobat 2. And keep your ears open, you might hear something familiar. For those of you well versed in Arrow the Acrobat 2's music, yes, that is, in fact, Borden's Zone Act 2. They had every right, though, to be very proud of this whole But this, we've only got one act. Nothing much else. It's an auto scrolling level. Plenty of bats and clown janitors. But that's all right. Nothing too amazing. It doesn't have to be. This is all build up. Now here what you want to do is you want to duck so that the pieces of glass just kind of bounce off of you. And these sections with little spikes. Those are invisible platforms, because they are not real, they are simply illusions of fallen spikes that were there. Good fucking god. There's a lot of health, there are a lot of free lives. You're not gonna have to be too worried, because this stage isn't very tough. Even for a kid, man, this can't be that hard. But I don't know what to say, I mean, it's... It's not a bad level, it's just not very difficult. I mean, they were ramping you up, though, for something real tough. Oh, 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 I, I know it's a kid's game, but just bear with me. I'm trying to be fair, but I think this game a little tricky in spots. And I feel like maybe, just maybe, it would be fair if they just gave you something real challenging. This is... This isn't really that tricky. I'm, I'm trying to stay near the front of the screen unless there's something that I need to scroll past. I don't know if it looks like I'm playing this very well or not. If I'm not playing well, I want you to be honest. I want you to tell me, wow, it looks like you can't play this game every day. This is kind of a tricky jump. I didn't, very, I didn't wait for it for very long, so... You know. But the, this level just gives you so much help. And the boss does something that I think is Oh, uh, we'll that. Yes, we will be fighting a good director. I'm sure you're fucking quivering in the knees waiting to see him. We'll discuss that. We'll discuss the whole thing. see, this is so much time to kill those one-ups. Of course, there's time to kill them. Now this... Oh, I wanted so bad to kill all of these. Same spin. Oh, it was so cool, but I didn't know. Okay, now I'm kind of running low on life. I should be a little bit more careful. They, see, but I'm not really fucking trying that hard. I'm just running through everything, blitzing it. There's no need for it. I could just be careful and cautious, but I don't want to do that. It's not very much fun. They gave me the option to fucking be an asshole at this last level, so that's what I'm going to do. They give you so much health, why wouldn't you just be a jerk the whole time? It's the idea behind this, I think. Yes, it's not. Maybe, maybe I misinterpreted why they designed it this way. Okay, now I should just stop running around and just kill things and not be a dick. Can I get this? Hooray! It's perfect. See that? Just when I thought there was something to be fucking worried about. Two health. Safe. And there's another health, just in case I fucked something else up. And there's another one, there you go. Jesus Christ. Can I get both these? Certainly can. See that? From all I just did, all the health that I collected, they gave me more health than I needed. I don't know. This feels more like a bonus round. Like, if you did really well, and you got... I, I, maybe if you, maybe they could have done this, like as a final, final world, it's just for fun, and had a real difficult final one. But if you like don't get a certain percent, you don't get to play this one. You get, the Edgar actor like runs away and he's like, ah, well, you didn't get enough of my goodies, you fucking cunt. You're never gonna see me again. And then he flies away. And you're like, oh no, now I have to play it again. This is all fucking stupid. This is some fan fiction. Bullshit. I'm skipping those one-ups. Too slow to get them. Oh, 
Oh, not playing this like Sonic the Hedgehog. And what the fuck was that? Three one-ups in a row. Here's our boss fight. This is terrifying. It's like every other boss fight. See, uh, you didn't see that because I was standing in front of it, but it did spit a bunch of fucking health at me. Just in case I had any difficulties getting here from that spot of one-ups and fucking hell. Jiminy Christmas. The only... The only thing that could be annoying is that he restores health. Then he gives you more health. So, there you go. He's... he's okay, and when he's in the air, just aim where the arrow is. Hit him. Oh, and he flies. Just hit him when he's running. I'm, I'm fucking just being a dickbag in this fight. I don't care. It's a silly fight. Silly man. Now these bombs only shoot one blast. Not three, so you are not two. You have nothing to be worried about. I just talk. Oh, not a big trouble. Oh, yeah. I usually don't fight him for this long, so I'm not used to seeing those janitors come out. Uh, Alright, I Knock it off. Come on, you are being silly. The match is over. Stop restoring your health. You're being terribly rude. And if I was a dick face, I could just say, like, Oh, I wonder why, how, why, if he could restore health down there, why wouldn't he just stay down there for it? Because it's a children's game. You should come out so you can fight him. Down. Person. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, I got him, I got him. Just one more, and then I can be done. Get out of here. Now that's the end of it. We've beaten Edgar Ector. Oh, oh man, I wonder what we can do. Don't, don't telegraph it too much. Okay, can we just press the stop button and train these points. I don't know if that's a very sound mechanical decision. I'm not a builder. That slide. Arrow, you should probably jump out. No big explosion effect or anything, but. Oh well. Here's our really amazing ending. I mean, I. Okay, I bashed the story, but the ending? Hoo boy. There you go. Okay, okay. Arrow got all the performers out, they fucking saved them, they probably all got some flying pepperoni pizzas. Oh, Hector escaped, of course. He's all... really? He's making a new plan that'll come out in... <laughs> Patasha was deported? Okay. You can say whatever you want about this story. That one line... <laughs> Oh yes, and Zero went to go be a spin-off game. <laughs> okay, I'm just saying, it's kind of funny to just read Batasha was deported. That, that's it. <laughs> oh my god. That, that kind of makes this shitty story worthwhile. But yes, Arrow the Acrobat became famous. He looks like Munchie from that Okay, I'm just gonna say he looks like Munchie. And if anybody fucking gets that reference, I want you to tell me. Because they shouldn't get it at all. That's a terrible reference to get. But that's that's the ending, man. It's nothing special. You get some fireworks. Acting like it's fucking kind of an amazing program, like it deserves all of this. But it was good, I like it a lot. You'll notice a lot of names will start repeating soon, but can't really blame them. It looked like a good, a good effort by all of these people. So I don't know what to say, man. They tried their best, and I, I can't claim they didn't do that, because they did good job, in my opinion. I like those music coordinators, Fox Productions, I appreciate your work on the, you know, the music sound field. I don't know who did this music, I didn't fucking research this, nobody cares. 
yeah, pick this up on Virtual Console if you like it. I don't know why you would, because I already showed you everything there is to enjoy about it. But try it for yourself, man. Don't just let me say, man, well, that's pretty good. No, try it for you. I don't know why I'm saying pick it up on Virtual Console. It's a Super Nintendo game. You're probably just going to get a ROM for it. Let's be honest. I'll be honest with all of you. I'll be honest with myself. You're not going to buy this. And if you do, well... You are an honest man, and you are a better man than I. Or lady. I, I doubt a woman will ever watch this story. Sunsoft, your thanks, and your very special thanks, are far longer than your own. Right? Oh, this game was in memory of someone? God damn, that's depressing. But at least it was a good game, right? Am I right? I, I don't know. I think I'm right. Thank you. Even says thank you. You're welcome, Arrow the Acrobat 2. Thank you for giving me an above average platforming experience. I said it. It's there. Goodbye.